Please be seated. Le Président, veuillez vous asseoir. The court is now in session. Reprise de and the chamber gives the floor to the defense counsel for Mr. Nguyen Chia. La chambre donne la parole I à would like to inform Nguyen. that the combined time for the two defense teams is one whole afternoon. You may proceed now. Vous avez la parole. Thank you, Mr. President. Good afternoon, Your Honors. Um, Mr. Witness, before the break, we were speaking about uh, an answer that you gave, um, and I would like to follow up on that, and that is by reading uh, another answer that you gave earlier to investigators, that is uh, E3-5521, question uh, 124. And the questions that the investigators asked you was the following. Um, for the period of three years, did you witness any arrests of people? And your answer is, the arrests were done confidentially. I never witnessed them. Um, my question is to you now, could you uh, elaborate this answer that you never really see any arrests of people ever? Mad. Answer. That is my true statement. I never witnessed uh, the arrests. They came at night time after they got the reports. Après they came to contact with the militia and uh, people were brought away during the night time and it was very quiet. Do you know what the reason was to be so quiet about arrests and why it happened at night time? Pourquoi c'était le silence Pourquoi c'était très tranquille Et pourquoi est-ce que cela se passait la nuit Answer. From what I knew, the arrest took place at night time because they did not want to let ordinary people knew about the arrest. Do you know, Mr. Witness, whether a distinction was made in the period of decay between so-called minor crimes on the one hand and serious crimes on the other hand? Was there such a difference, to your knowledge? Answer. Réponse. I could not give you my uh, guess or my prediction how uh, the two how the two were different because I I was not aware of the two. Était la différence entre les deux, ni vous en une sorte de In your que years je pas at uh, Ningnang, as community chief, um, chef de commune, nobody ever stole a coconut. Or cassava, for instance. Answer. When I was in Nyanyong commune, I, it, it was not the commune, it was the office. Ce n'était pas à la commune. I was dealing in economic and I never witnessed any stealing of uh, coconuts or of any other properties. Have you, have you, have you ever heard of people within your commune being accused of stealing something because they were hungry?
ปัญหานี้ก็ Answer I never witnessed I never heard of it Je n'en ai jamais entendu parler Je n'en ai jamais été témoin Maître Coco Another topic that we already spoke about and you spoke about it earlier um, that is re-education uh, that is a follow-up question um, to a question before the break do you know of any instances of people who were re-educated multiple times people who were Send coming back. Send coming back. You might have answered this question already in other words, but I would like to make sure what your experience was. Have you ever heard of people who were sent multiple times for re-education? Some answer. I never witnessed people was sent multiple times. I knew that uh, people were sent for edu ed re-education and they disappeared. Uh, for this instance, I have heard of. Um. Very well. I would like to ask you another question on another topic, Mr. Witness, and that is um, your statement E3-5521, your answer to questions 25 and 27. Um, question 25 reads as follows. In 1975, did you see the evacuation of people? And your answer is, I saw people evacuated from the city. They traveled along the road toward their individual birth districts. In case people who did not have the birth district, they asked to stay as citizens in that village or district. And uh, questions 827, when people came to live in the village, was there any instruction plan? The upper echelon instructed to have those people live in one location, either in the pagoda or in the school. Later on, they were divided to go to the villages. Upon arrival in the villages, in the village, they ate commonly with the base people. Uh, my first question, Mr. Witness, is about um, people who had come from the city and traveled to what you called individual birth districts. Um, how were you able to determine that people who came from Phnom Penh actually had returned to their birth uh, district? Answer. Phnom Penh evacuees, they traveled along the road, they pull cards, they push cards, they travel, some people were traveling by car, and they had some small belongings. And there was the announcement that so those who came from which uh, birth districts, they should go back to their birth districts. But in your years as community of Ningnang, for instance, um, were you able to tell who from the original evacuees had in fact returned uh, to their birth district? Comment pouviez-vous dire ou être certain que les personnes qui avaient été évacuées étaient bel et bien revenues dans leur village natal Comme some answer. I once again would like to inform you that Réponse. I was in the office. I never became a commune Je ne suis chief. Chef de commune. People from Phnom Penh Les were traveling Phnom along Penh the road near my office, and uh, they said they were came f they were from a Kampot province, Ils and some said that they were from uh, nearby villages. villages. And I was told that uh, they were traveling to find their parents. 
pour retrouver leurs parents là où ils étaient nés. I know it's a it's a difficult question, but are you able to give a percentage of people who had arrived from Phnom Penh? Uh, how many of the people who you saw were in fact or had in fact returned to their birth village? Sont véritablement retournés dans leur village natal. Answer. At that time, I did not know how many of them, and I could not give you the statistic, but I could see people were traveling. I do not know how many families were traveling to their birth districts. Some people were traveling to the west uh, to Kampot province, and some were traveling to Tukmir. Uh, so I could not Tukmir. tell you the percentage. I understand, Mr. Witness, but the reason I'm asking you the question is because you uh, yourself made the distinction. Um, but could you indicate whether the majority of the people coming from Phnom Penh uh, were in fact people who had returned to the birth district. Answer. I do not get your question. Please repeat your question, please. I'll, I'll move on, Mr. Witness. Um, people who had come from Phnom Penh, um, either returning to the birth district or not, um, were they, in your knowledge, discriminated against because there were people coming from Phnom Penh? Est-ce qu'elles étaient discriminées par rapport aux autres personnes qui étaient dans le village parce qu'elles venaient de Phnom Penh? Answer. Réponse. First, uh, people were not discriminated. D'abord, il faut savoir que les gens Phnom, people ne from pas de discrimination. Phnom Penh or from Dakar province, Penh, they were allowed to live in cooperatives. Avaient le droit de vivre dans des coopératives. At the beginning, there were no proper uh, settlers and uh, some people were living with uh, their parents for Au a début, temporary period of time and some others uh, were living in, at, in schools in Pagoda, so they were pagoda. eating commonly, communally with uh, base people at that time, at the beginning. But were you ever instructed to treat the people who had just arrived from Phnom Penh worse than the people who had already lived there, for instance, in terms of food or working conditions, or, were, or was everybody treated the same? Answer. As I told the court already at the beginning, people were treated equally. They were eating together. There were no clear plans and there was no distinctions at the beginning. So, in other words, no such policy from the, upper, from the upper echelon existed. You were not instructed to make any distinction between the people. Is that correct? President, please hold on, Mr. Winner. You may proceed now, International Co Prosecutor. J'ai une objection, Monsieur le Président. I have an objection, Mr. President. La réponse a été formulée de la manière suivante. The à deux reprises, le témoin a dit que c'était au début que les gens étaient traités de la même manière. Il n'a pas dit donc jusqu'à quand, dans quelle période. Et là, on entend une question qui généralise globalement le traitement des, des personnes déplacées. 
sans non plus préciser la période. Je crois que ce serait utile qu'on sache de quelle période on parle. Merci. And it is important for us to know what that period is. Thank you. Very well, Mr. President. I will specify. Mr. Witness, you've testified that there was no difference in treatment between 17 April people or new people and the old people. Was that the same for every year? Was were the people treated the same in 1975, 1976, 1977, 1978? Answer. I do not really get your question. I uh, would like to consult with uh, my duty counsel first. President, it's not the, the it's not a question which uh, lead to self-incrimination. So your answer may not lead to any prosecution against you. Uh, you may uh, consult with your duty counsel when it comes to the question which uh, leads to self-incrimination. Uh, after you got the question. After you got a question from the party, you may give your response. So uh, your answer may be the result of the uh, statement you gave to investigator of the OCIJ in the past uh, Time. Thank you very much. Uh, as I informed the court already, at the beginning they were eating together, they were working together, and after that, people were put in different groups. Uh, there were 17 uh, April people group, and they were living, living in different groups from uh, base people. Um, I understand. Thank you, Mr. Witness. But my question uh, relates more to discriminatory measures, treating one group more badly than the other group. Um, your testimony was, I believe, no, but my question is, was there any change in treatment? Was the treatment the same in 1975, 76, and 77, and so on? Can I get answer? In 1975, as I said, people were equal. Tout le monde était traité when it comes to 1976, late 1976, some people who were evacuated from different places, they were put in uh, the units, and they were allowed to live uh, with base people as well. Mr. Benes, do you remember an instruction in the summer of 1978 um, indicating that the division between base people and 17 April people was to be uh, abolished? Cette instruction, les divisions entre les peuples de base et les peuples nouveaux devaient être abolies. Answer in 1978, I knew that uh, the division was abolished uh, and there was an announcement that uh, people were to be treated equally, no matter that uh, they were 17 April people or they were base people. The division was abolished in late 1978. But how does that compare to your answer that people weren't discriminated? Mais vous avez dit que dès le départ, il n'y avait pas de discrimination. Alors comment peut-on avoir par la suite aboli les divisions s'il n'y avait pas de discrimination
B the moon answer at the beginning there was no discrimination and after that the division of people over imposed on a commencé in late 1978, uh, people were again treated uh, equally. On a à nouveau traité les gens it was a prohibit, prohibited that uh, uh, there was no discussion of uh, 17 April uh, people. So people from uh, 1978 were treated e equally. Uh, thank you, Mr. Thank you, Mr. Witness. Last question. Um, Merci, do you Monsieur le témoin. Dernière question. know how many people were living in Nang Nang commune in 1975 the numbers of people who were living in the Je ne savais pas combien de personnes I, uh, dans la have commune de statistic. Je n'avais pas de statistiques. Only the commune commu committee Seul knew about the statistics. I uh, was not aware how many Moi, people, how many families, uh, how many families were living in Nyanyo. Dans la commune de Nyanyo. Thank you, Mr. Witness. Thank you, Mr. President. Maître Copejean, nous terminons. Je vous remercie. Now I give the floor to the defense team for Mr. Kyusen Pon to put your question to this witness. Council Kongsamon, thank you, Mr. President. Uh, Mr. Witness, I uh, would like to seek your clarification on uh, your answer concerning the difference uh, between commune committees and Commune office. You stated earlier already that uh, you were dealing with economics, food supply, and so on. I would like to seek your clarification. What were the cadres uh, doing in the commune uh, office, and how uh, was uh, the commune office different from uh, commune uh, committee? Le bureau de la commune était-il différent du comité de la commune? <coughs> Answer. Thank you very much. Commune. Réponse, je vous remercie. Committees were dealing with uh, administration. They were supervising people. For those who were working in the office, the commune office, they were dealing with uh, food supplies. They would supply the food for people. So at the beginning, uh, communes and villages would come to seek a food supply from uh, the commune. And the commune uh, chief uh, would decide on food supply. Le chef de la qui la and uh, Bunsi was the former chief of the commune, and uh, I heard that he was he is now living in Ktuam San. À Ktuam San. Question. Question. What year are you referring to? De quelle année s'agit-il? Answer. Réponse. I am referring to the period of 1975, Je 1976. I did not know whether in late 1976 or late 1977. He was uh, uh, sending to live in Kampung Cham, and after Bunsi, it was Tassum who was the Bunsi, commune chief. And at that time, I left the, the commune, commune already. La commune. Question. Question. You haven't uh, told the court concerning the the people who were working in uh, the commune office. Mais vous n'avez pas dit à la chambre ce qu'il en était des gens qui travaillaient au bureau de la commune. Could que you tell the court about the members of the chambre. commune office? Vous des membres du bureau de la commune. 
answer in the commune office there were only me and two messengers Il avait que moi the two messengers messenger would uh, send a letter to request a food or vegetable from uh, villages and in the commune uh, committee, there was a clerk to Ensuite, do the registry. And as for the clerk, he is, all, he is deceased. Cette personne est aujourd'hui décédée. Council, thank you very Maître much. Je vous Were you a member of the commune committee at that time? De commune à l'époque. Answer. At that réponse. time, I uh, was not uh, part of the commune committee. Je I was uh, in charge of the commune office, particularly commune, uh, in dealing with uh, economics to supply food for vivre, different uh, units in the commune. Dans les Council. Could you once again tell Question. me the me composition of uh, the commune committee? Perhaps there was a, a head of the commune committee and there was a secretary or there was a clerk. Could you tell the names of uh, those who were in the commune committee? Answer. Thank you. Bunsi was the head Bunsi of the commune. Était le chef de la commune. And as for the deputy, Pour ce qui est de son adjoint, I did not know her surname. Eh bien, je ne connaissais pas son nom. Her, her first name was Sun. Son nom and Tio was the member. Tachun was also a member. Tachun était également membre. And the clerk who wrote the report uh, was Mr. Yo. He was deceased Yo. already. Lo Yo was uh, not the member Lo of the commune committee. He was the clerk uh, dealing Il with uh, the report. Le de de Question, did you work? Or did you work dealing with the uh, military affairs with the commune office? Est-ce que vous vous occupiez des questions militaires dans le bureau de la commune? Answer. As I have Réponse. stated, Comme je I déjà dit, was a soldier engaging in the battlefield in Takeo. J'étais soldat sur le champ de bataille à Takeo. And that was in 1973. En 1973. And later on, I became Par ill. And I contracted malaria. And then I was transferred to work at the Nyanyong office. Et été au de and Nyanyong. that happened in early or mid-1974. Cela au début des années de l'année 1974, au 1974. Mais moi, je voulais vous parler des soldats de la commune. Was you involved with the uh, commune soldiers? Je voulais savoir si vous travailliez avec les soldats I de la commune. I did not uh, refer to the time that you were a soldier in a battlefield. Je vous étiez soldat sur le champ de bataille, sur le front. Answer. Seng was in charge of Réponse. the uh, commune soldiers des as well soldats as de la uh, commune. Chun. De même que Chun. Uh, he was the brother-in-law of Si. Du beau -frère de si. He is currently living in uh, Neil, a uh, commune, Tramcock district. district de Tramcock. Question. Let Question. me clarify with you. Précisons so ensemble, you si never worked or dealt, dealt with the commune soldiers or army, is that correct? President, Mr. Witness, please wait for the microphone to be operational first. Micro soit allumé, vous plaît, le témoin. Witness, I le already témoin. told you 
that I used to be a soldier in a battlefield soldat sur le council. I want you to clarify it about the oui. commune soldiers. Of course, we heard you talk about being commune. a soldier in 1973 in a battlefield. But I'd like to specify it about the commune soldier. Was, in, were you in charge of a commune soldiers? Je voulais savoir si vous étiez responsable des soldats somewhere in Takai province. De la commune ou quelque part dans la province de Takeo. Answer. No, uh, I did not while I worked uh, Réponse. at a commune. Non, je ne l'ai pas fait lorsque je travaillais pour la commune. Question. You question. were questioned by Judge Lavain Le juge about uh, uh, Tahoe and that you uh, knew him. Il vous a demandé si vous le connaissiez. Did you ever work uh, together with Tahoe? Avez-vous travaillé avec Tahoe? Mr. President, uh, Mr. Witness, please wait for the microphone to be operated first. Monsieur le témoin, que votre micro soit allumé. Witness. Le témoin. At that time, Tahoe was chief of Lebo commune. À était le chef de la commune de Lebo. And in 1976 or mid-1976, I was transferred to be there, and I was a member of the uh, commune, and Tahoe was the chief, and there was another who was his deputy. Question, in your capacity, as a member of that commune committee, what was your responsibility? Answer, as a member, Réponse. I was assigned to uh, deal with uh, the dry season farming membre, at the de de Kampung and that was in Treng district. Dans le district de Treng. I was also assigned to uh, dig uh, canals Nous with other workers. À la construction de canaux. Question. Did you Question. have any specific responsibility, for example, as a member of the uh, committee, en tant que membre du comité, you were assigned to be a, in charge of a logistics or economics or de, uh, military de, de affairs? De Can you tell a call about that? Militaire. Pourriez-vous euh, répondre à ce sujet, s'il vous plaît? The chief was in charge of all of, of, of all affairs, and the deputy le was in charge of the ça, uh, economics, and a member in my capacity was in charge of uh, culture. Moi, de la culture. Question: Can you recall or that you uh, knew Question. about it? that you were actually assigned to be in charge of uh, the, the culture as a member Comment of the uh, commune committee. En charge de la culture en President, tant que Mr. Witness, please uh, be mindful of the microphone. Faire attention au micro, vous plaît, le témoin. Witness. Le témoin. At that, that time, that was how uh, it was assigned. Ainsi que les uh, that is a specific à duty for the chief, the deputy, and the member of the commune committee. Du comité de la commune tous des on, so you were assigned in charge of uh, culture, and what did you do uh, for that specific task or specific assignment? Et qu'avez-vous fait de précis en la matière? Answer. I advised each unit Je to unité teach young children. Recommander à chaque unité de dispenser un enseignement However, aux the enfants. teaching was not uh, formal. The intention was to teach children formel, to, to know how to read and to write alphabets. 
And it happened under a house or under a tree. The teachers did not have any proper qualification, but only those who knew more than the ones they taught. Were you the direct supervisor of teachers in Libo commune where you were a member and the whole was? The chief, or was it somebody else? Answer: There were other teachers who were in charge. Réponse: D'autres enseignants étaient responsables. There was a chief of the commune uh, female group. Il y avait le who chef was the, uh, du groupe des femmes de la commune qui était euh, le responsable direct. Question and your uh, duties uh, as the one who was in charge of culture. What Et was your uh, relationship between teachers and Quel other cadres who dealt with uh, the uh, cultural issue? Qui s'occupait des questions relatives à la culture? Answer. The relationship uh, between Réponse. the teachers and myself was that I advised those teachers uh, to try to work Je hard to teach the teacher uh, to those uh, male and female children. Garçons, and as I said uh, earlier, when Et those children had free times, they would go and collect libres, a cow dung to make a natural fertilizer. Pour, uh, so it means they uh, would engage in this work for two to three hours Et and attend the uh, class for ans. one to two hours. Et puis, il, trois heures, pardon. Ils avaient des cours qui duraient une à deux heures. Question. Did you receive any report on the outcome Question. of the study of those uh, children? Avez-vous reçu des rapports concernant les résultats obtenus par les enfants qui suivaient ces cours? Answer: Yes, I did receive a, a study report uh, as they were done by those teachers. Oui, ce sont les enseignants qui présentaient leurs rapports. At that time, teachers also à received textbooks for teaching. Les enseignants se voyaient également remettre des manuels. Question. Since you received reports. Question. Can you tell the court Et whether donné, by uh, the end those students or children could read or write? Can you tell the court whether those students or children could read or write? Can you tell the court whether read or Certains d'entre eux pouvaient could lire. The, the alphabets. Ils pouvaient lire l'alphabet. However, their knowledge was rather limited. Mais je dirais que leur connaissance était assez limitée. Question. I have a, a general question to put to you. Question. Je vais vous poser une question d'ordre général relativement au principe du PCK. You actually stated that you were a candidate member of the CPK. And my question is the following. What principles or core principles of the CPK that you learned? Quel principe généraux fondamentaux concernant le PCK avez-vous appris? Answer. I'll uh, respond to your questions based on the, what I uh, can recollect. 
as a candidate member, the rights that we had were not as equal as the ones who were uh, recognized as a full rights members. However, we would we could be in a, a leading a position to lead people to work at our base. For the full rights uh, members, base, they had the, the authority to produce reports to the uh, upper level, des, that is, to the district or to the sector level, etc. Question. My question is on the uh, principle Question. Related to Moi, the policies of CPK, do you recall any major uh, principles on those policies of the CPK? Answer. As I am now getting old, I can recall those uh, principles. Je de là, je, je there are pas à me only a few uh, that I, uh, I can recollect now. That is, je first, uh, to organize the people at our best. Second, to organize the, the work or the affairs uh, inside the party travaux, uh, properly. Au parti, le mieux possible. Question. Can you elaborate Question. a bit further on what the organization of the work inside the, the, the party rank? What do you mean by that? Answer. This implied that we had to be Réponse. loyal to the CPK without swaying uh, or without going offside and to strictly follow the line, the political line of the CPK. Question. What about uh, the uh, food supply issue? Question. Et qu'en est-il des rations alimentaires, ou de l'approvisionnement alimentaire? Answer. On this matter, at each uh, base, we had to strive to deal with the uh, living condition of the people Nous devions and try not to encounter uh, any food shortage, that is to produce food uh, sufficiently. Nous devions essayer Question, la uh, this morning, at about 11.09 hours, you uh, made a response, and let me quote that the upper echelon instructed the uh, commune level to provide sufficient food to the people, unquote. On this issue, that is, the uh, commune level was instructed to provide sufficient food to the people. What measures did you take in order to ensure that uh, there was sufficient food supplied in your commune? Answer. As I stated this morning, Comme je dit ce matin, in Sri Renaud commune that Sri I uh, took charge, we organized various units, for example, uh, a unit responsible for planting white tables, de des and another unit to restore uh, livestock, Une autre including pigs and cows. Bétail, and the cows uh, who, which were raised uh, in a pen and the uh, cows uh, on the field. And the economic section was assigned to go and find fish et puis, il y avait une as a supplementary uh, daily food supply. And every 10 day, I Tous managed to jours, give uh, people meat to Je eat. Sometimes it was pork and sometimes de, it was either beef or chicken. Ou de ou de à la 
and usually or almost on a daily basis uh, the soup given to the people jours, was that of a vegetable mix uh, with a chicken aux habitants c'était une soupe composée de légumes d'un mélange de légumes et de poulet can you also tell the court Question. about the food shortage in your Pouvez-vous commune? Parler à la cour, what was the uh, level uh, of uh, seriousness of a food shortage? Was it a, a severe food shortage, for example, or was it just a, a slight uh, and unnoticeable food shortage? Mineur. That is based on your implementation as instructed to ensure sufficient food supply for the people in your commune. Dans le cadre de l'application des consignes qui vous été, avaient été données dans le domaine alimentaire. Answer. Indeed, there was a food Réponse. shortage, and in percentage, for example, uh, we. There were about 30 percent, 30 percentage of food shortage, as I could deal with about 70 percent. Previously, uh, Ta Khun, who was the former Auparavant, commune Ta-Kun, chief, did not uh, commune, raise the level of percentage of food supply there, as well as I did uh, during my reign. À résoudre le problème de la pénurie alimentaire ou à la rendre moins fréquente. Ce and moi, immediately, in fait, fait uh, upon my ar- arrival, I increased the food supply effet, based on the actual situation. Alimentaire dès mon arrivée dans la commune. And in fact, yes, uh, previously uh, they did raise. Uh, livestock, but they did not uh, provide the meat from the livestock to the people in the commune. Question. You said that they did not uh, resolve the uh, living condition. Did you mean that they raised the livestock but did not uh, share it with the people? Le, il y avait du bétail qui était élevé, mais qui n'était pas distribué, yes, partagé uh, avec les villageois, qui n'avaient pas leurs conditions de vie. Est-ce que j'ai bien compris Réponse oui, Question. c'est exact. And Question. Can you tell the court why the commune chief who was there chambre, before you arrived did not uh, provide le chef pork qui vous a or beef or chicken to the people? Ne fournissait pas de porc, ni de poulet, ni de bœuf à la population. Answer. Réponse. Based on my observation, their uh, solution to the problem was limited. L'on pouvait apporter des solutions uh, only, uh, very little meat was given in in the soup because the soup mainly consisted of vegetables, and that's what I saw, and that's what I learned from people in various units. Les when I asked them, they said that they did not have f- enough food to eat. Pas à Question. Question. So, uh, upon your arrival to be overall in charge of uh, the various communes that we worked with, namely uh, Leibo, Srai Runung, and Nyanyong. What was the feedback from uh, the people? Did uh, the people tell you that uh, they had sufficient food to eat or food shortage remained? That is the, the, the general feedback from the people when you uh, went there to uh, resolve this uh, issue. Vous avez de résoudre les problèmes, que, que vous ont dit en général les habitants? Answer. I did not uh, receive any feedback Réponse. while I was in Nyanyong commune and in the Lebo commune. commune. Ni dans la commune de Lebo. There was a, a quite a severe shortage because that was a former battlefield. Et il y avait une grave pénurie élémentaire en raison and Des for that reason, I tried to resolve uh, the C'est issue by working the rice, the dry season farming. En, en, 
favorisant la culture de riz de saison sèche. And to organize a unit to engage in a plantation. To, to produce cassava so it, it could be used to mix with the uh, rice. Du manioc que l'on pouvait par la suite mélanger avec le riz. And while I was in the Sri Renong commune in 1928, I again resolved uh, the living condition of the people there. In fact, uh, there was a food storage but at, at economic section of that commune, but they did not distribute it to the people. But by the time I went there, I distributed je, je those food, the, the food to the people. That's why they lied me. Pourquoi, and they told me uh, that Kun, who was uh, the former commune chief, did not provide commune, sufficient food to them to eat. And wherever he went, people would just uh, try to get out of his way. Question, now I'd like to uh, move to another subject. Question, à un autre While sujet you were in Lebo a commune, Lorsque vous étiez dans la commune de Lebo, can you tell the exact time that you, you were there, or when you were a member of the other commune community? Uh, à quel moment exactement vous êtes devenu membre de cette commune? Answer. Réponse. I was in Libo commune probably from mid 1976 through late 1977 and in March 1978 or May 1978 I was transferred to take charge of Renault commune and further on in late 78 I was transferred to be in charge of Antasam commune and I was there only for two months before the regime fell question question were you aware of uh, delegations from the upper echelon or from the or from the center to uh, visit your area, in particular to Je visit uh, Liebo commune. Dans la commune de Liebo en particulier. And so, while I was uh, working there, Réponse. Lorsque je travaillais là-bas, after I uh, I was assigned by Tamok to build a huge uh, cooperative hall. Tamok m'a demandé de faire construire un... The hall in the commune chief was transferred to the north zone and Take replaced him. There was a Chinese couloir. delegation Chung Kung Hui et il y a une who came to visit their cooperative. Qui est venu dans la cooperative. And Ta Sand was in charge Ta of Sand receiving that uh, delegation. De cette delegation. Question. Were you aware of a visit by Question. other delegations? Avez -vous entendu parler de visite d'autres delegations? Answer no, Réponse. I was not. No. Questioned. In relation to Question. document E1 slash two five three slash one, which was a transcript of uh, the hearing that twenty seven January two thousand and fifteen. 27 janvier 2015 at about fourteen zero three forty five seconds a civil party who testified before this chamber spoke about the your presence Et a mentionné votre présence 
and you were referred to as Dano because uh, that the uh, civil party did not know your full name. La partie civile ne connaissait pas votre nom complet. Elle vous a donc appelé Tano. The civil party also uh, stated that, and let me quote. Elle a indiqué, la partie civile a indiqué, je la question. cite. You Question. refer to a Tano in paragraph 25, paragraph 25 of your Tano statement. Dans votre procès verbal d'audition. And uh, do you know his full name? And what was his uh, position? Et savez-vous quelle était Answer. quelle était ses fonctions? His name Réponse. was Tano. He worked at the uh, commune office with the Hone, but I do not know his full name. I only complet. knew he was uh, known as the No. Everybody was afraid when he or she saw the No. We had to work uh, quickly because we were afraid of him as he was rather cruel or, or strict. End of quote. Fin de citation. I also to add uh, another uh, extract, a little bit above what I just read to you, extrait, in response to the question. De ce que je viens de vous lire. You also uh, mentioned of the name Tahun. Le nom de Tahun it was in fact Tahun. Il s'agissait de Tahun. Do you know his, uh, what he, which position he held at the time? Answer. His name was Tahun, and he was the uh, commune chief who was in charge, who was a uh, superior of uh, Tano. And Tano Le was in charge Tano, of the uh, commune military. Tano était en of militaire. Fin de citation. Can you tell the uh, court again Pourriez whether you were in charge of uh, the military at the uh, commune? Charge des questions militaires au niveau de la commune. While you were a member of uh, Tahoe. Lorsque vous étiez, lorsque vous travailliez avec Tahoe. And uh, while I was at the Hoyne's member, I was not in charge of the military. It was Saud who was in charge of the military affair. And I was uh, merely a member of the commune committee. Of course, uh, people could make various interpretations based on their observations. Some people, some of us were liked by other people, some were afraid of us, etc. Counsel, thank you very much. Uh, could you clarify it for the court about the, the fact that uh, you were afraid, or people were afraid of that? Si les gens avaient peur de ta. Uh, could you say that it is because uh, the activity you uh, were acted, you were acting on people, that's why people were afraid of ta? C'était à cause des activités qui étaient menées contre les personnes par votre truchement au nom de ta. Always had a big voice, and and I I, I was uh, normal with people. However, during the meeting, I uh, spoke uh, very loudly, and I had big voice. That is why the, some people were afraid of me. What I said was truth, and uh, I had loud voice, as I said. Counsel, thank you. Did you ever punish or reprimand? 
question. People Avez-vous jamais puni which ou réprimandé des gens? Which show that uh, you were cruel. That is why people were afraid of you while you were working uh, in the bar. Ce qui vous aurait rendu cruel et qui aurait expliqué pourquoi les gens avaient peur de vous. Answer. I never punished or Réponse. never reprimanded je anyone. Puni, I had a loud voice and I always encouraged people to work hard so that we could solve our lively food. Pour que nous puissions subvenir à nos besoins. Actually, as I said, I had loud voice and when I used dit, the loudspeaker, my voice would even be louder and people perhaps uh, were afraid of uh, me because of my voice. Counsel, thank you very much. When uh, you were questioned by um, Mr. Copé, you stated that when you were in charge of the commune, que lorsque vous étiez responsable de la commune, commune, lorsque c'était vous qui étiez chef de la commune, you never arrested, uh, people. vous n'avez jamais arrêté qui que ce soit. But when the question dealt uh, with the arrest, uh, you said that the arrest happened at uh, night time. During that time, Mais it was very quiet. Vous avez Did you recall your statement? La nuit et que tout se faisait dans le silence. And uh, I would like to ask uh, a question in relation si oui, to this matter. Concerning the arrest uh, at uh, night time, did it happen when you were Head of the commune. Les arrestations qui avaient lieu la nuit avaient également lieu à l'époque où vous étiez chef de la commune. Answer. I told the court already the arrest happened during the Takun reign. J'ai déjà dit que les arrestations avaient lieu à l'époque de Takun. I uh, secretly asked people J'ai and I was told that the people secret, were arrested at uh, night time while Takun was in charge. À l'époque de Takun. When I uh, was transferred to Sri Nonong, there were no arrests of people for re-education. Counsel, please. Uh, clarified uh, your answer, Mr. Witness. Uh, you said that uh, you never arrested anyone for re-education. Did you want to say that there were no arrests at all of people for re-education while you were uh, working in the Personne commune committee in Sri Nono? Answer. In Sri Nono commune, Dans la commune de there were no arrests uh, while I was the, in the commune committee. Il n'y avait pas d'arrestation tant que j'étais when I was au at Tour Cruz digging the canal, I, I knew that a few people, one or two, Je sais que quelques personnes, une ou deux personnes, ont disparu. At that time, the unit of the district and sectors were in charge of that area, and we were there to dig uh, canals, and uh, the work site was far away from the Sri Rono Council. Concerning Sri Rono, à ce sujet, au sujet de Sri Rono. Did you know whom were they that they were arrested Savez-vous while uh, you were working in commune committee? So Look at that. Answer. I told the court already Mais j'ai déjà répondu before there à were arrests. But when I was transferred to be in charge of that area, there were no arrests. Les arrestations ont lieu avant que je n'arrive. Lorsque Thank j'ai you very été much. muté I sur place, il n'y avait plus d'arrestations. Well now. Could you bien, again clarify it for me?
why was there a difference uh, between uh, uh, the time between uh, the way you supervise uh, uh, Sri Nong commune and the way Bien other été. people supervise Sri Nong commune la façon dont vous supervisiez la commune et la façon dont les autres s'occupaient et géraient la commune <coughs> answer Réponse. it depends on the one's mind because we C'est une question d'état d'esprit. Have different minds in the way we supervise. Uh, Chacun voyait les choses à sa manière. Chiefs, uh, perhaps uh, they were absolute. Certains chefs étaient absolus. They wished to uh, lead forward, and for me, I was Eux kind. I bon was gentle. Moi, so gentil. the methods that we supervise people donc, were different. In Sri Ranong commune, I uh, was in charge of general tasks. So it was me who deal and engage in uh, general tasks. So as I said, it different. It depends on the, those who supervise, and it depends disais, on their minds. Council, thank you very much. In relation to your testimony, which you have just stated now, you said that it uh, depends on the people's heart or people's mind. I would like to ask you whether there was a policy from the Moi, upper echelon in relation place, to the administration of the commune, au sujet de l'administration de la commune qui aurait été envoyée par les chefs Or did the commune have the authority to la supervise uh, the commune on their own will? pour tout superviser, prendre des décisions de son propre chef. Answer. There was order Réponse. from the central to zone to sector Les ordres to the districts. La zone aller ensuite au secteur, puis au district. But some communes, Mais perhaps they did not follow the order on some occasion because the commune was uh, close to the people and if we followed uh, whatever si ordered from the top, uh, the situation would be confused. And for some matters, we would deal the matter peacefully. And as I said, uh, some commune chiefs, uh, the, the chiefs were absolute, disais, so they had their own administration. Absolute, ils avaient leur propre administration. Council, thank you. In relation to your answer just now, you said there was an order from uh, the center. La Défense, vous avez dit what que kind of order was it? Could you give me an example in relation to such order? Answer. There was an order from the top. required us to supervise uh, our commune, our cooperative. Notre et notre we commune. were asked uh, to strive to deal with the situation of uh, the people, particularly in uh, food uh, supplies. Gens, and we were asked to, uh, to produce uh, good yields so that we could uh, solve the livelihood of the people. And uh, we were also asked and required to increase the, the population among people. Some communes which uh, could not uh, deal with all these matter, they were accused of uh, reluctant 
to follow the order of the party. I was uh, working very hard. I ate with On people de, de, de so that I could uh, supervise my courage, commune well. Avec les gens pour superviser correctement la commune. And uh, at that time, uh, there was the plan set for people as well uh, when they had to visit their families. And we were afraid at that time. Council, uh, President, thank you, uh, Mr. Council. It is now convenient time for a short break. The chamber will have a short break from now on until 3 o'clock. Court officer, please facilitate a proper room for uh, this witness and for uh, the duty council and also for a reserve witness. And uh, please have uh, Mr. this witness and his duty council, council back uh, to the courtroom before 3 p.m. The court is now adjourned.